I don't know how to start this video, but today I want to take a look at Minecraft's worst servers. So I found the list of all the Minecraft servers out there, and I'm going to look at the bottom of the list. We're going to see just what the worst servers in Minecraft look like. But before that, a quick message from our sponsor. This is a message from our friends at Apex Minecraft Hosting. With an easy-to-use panel, 24-7 live chat support, the easy and obvious choice is with Apex Minecraft Hosting. Just ask this guy. I think Apex is re really good, and you, you should get it. Can you put your trident down now? See, he loves it. As said before, anybody can be a server owner with Apex. If you can't decide on what version to use, Apex has over 200 one-click installable mod packs and minigames to choose from. And if there's an active promo code, you can find it on screen now. Thank you guys for choosing Apex, and enjoy the rest of the video. Make sure to hit like, subscribe, and join my Discord down below. Let's get right into it. So here we have the website that lists all of the Minecraft servers out there. Now, I don't mean every single Minecraft server, I just mean the ones that choose to advertise themselves on here. You know, there are recognizable names such as EarthMC or Pixelmon or... Yeah, that's about it. Anyway, so, there's pages on here. There's 24,626 servers on here. So you know what that means. It's time to go to the very back page and see what's back here. Yeah, as I expected, nobody's really on here except for this guy right here. Bloom MC SMP with six people online. But here's their IP. We're going to go ahead and copy that. Oh, cool. I got to click the download button. Let's see. We got six players. They got a Discord. Last ping was a minute ago. They're based out of the UK. So let me read their little description here. Welcome to our enchanting world. Join our new semi-vanilla SMP Minecraft server where whimsical adventures await. Immerse yourself in a charming community of like-minded players who embrace the spirit of our collaboration and creativity. Explore the pristine landscape, gather resources, and build your dream abode amidst a backdrop of blooming metals, towering trees, and babbling brooks. With a touch of magic and a sprinkle of warmth, our server invites you on an to embark on a delightful journey where friendship blossoms, laughter echoes, and the joy of Minecraft is cherished. So grab your pickaxe, don your favorite colorful attire, and let your imagination soar in this small heaven. We can't wait to welcome you to our family of playful adventures. Okay, that was a lot, and uh, clearly he paid someone on Fiverr to do that because that was a lot of adjectives. Like, a lot. Okay, so we'll save that one, and let's go find another. We'll have to go back a page, but that's okay. Crusader Craft. Here we go. Five out of 30 people online. Here's their IP. Go ahead and copy that. Introducing Crusader Craft, a thrilling, immersive Minecraft experience like no other. Designed with a meticulous attention to detail by renowned YouTuber, The Blue Crusader, Crusader Craft transport you to a world of PvP, PvE, and factions, combining the thrill of combat with the fun of survival. Running on the latest Minecraft 1.19 version, Crusader Craft offers a classic old st old school Minecraft style. Okay, yep. Yeah. So this seems to be sort of an RPG kind of like fighter server, which okay, let's let's keep that in mind. <laughs> See, I would join this one, but uh, nobody's playing. Hmm. Debo Craft, they got no banner. Okay. 18 plus. How are they gonna know? Okay. Exciting plugins including Townie, Economy, MMCO, Memo, 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 New Enchantments, Proximity Chat, and Jobs. Our server offers a dynamic and immersive environment for players. Okay. This seems like. Okay. Copy that bad Larry. And we'll grab one more just for gits and shiggles. Chill. That has 95 people online. Okay. This is the best server I've ever been on. I would recommend this server to everyone that plays Minecraft and no other server. It is super chill like it is said on the title. Okay. All right. I think that's enough for today's video. I'm going to give myself a limit of 45 minutes on each server. And then we'll give it a ranking. How are the rankings going to work? I have genuinely no clue. I, I really don't. We're, we're going to figure it out as we go. So, we're going in order. The first SMP here is the Bloom SMP. And this is the one that had a bajillion adjectives in the name. So, let's see. Okay, starting it off with a really weird icon. Like to see it. 
pixel message of the day, your legacy update. All right, let's go. <sighs> what, what, okay, what does this even mean? Do I have an outdated version? Hold on. All right, guys, we are back on 1. Point, or not back. This is actually my first time playing 1.20, sadly. Even though it just came out as of uh, me recording this, that's fine. Don't worry about it. All right. Go ahead and see what this server is all about. Join the Discord. Oh my lordy lord, look at this. It's filled with purple stuff. Hell done. Resource packs. Let's just get rid of these guys. We don't need them. All right, um. So, first impressions are underwhelming, to say the least. Yeah, sorry for the temporary spawn. Okay. So, my guess is that they just updated to the new version and they really haven't gotten a spawn done just yet. That's okay. Good to know they already have a support system here. Bloom MC. Okay. RTP somewhere randomly in the wild. Interesting. Okay. Oh, so this seems to be the uh, the owner. Yeah. Hey yo. Show show me what you got here. <laughs> I, I know I probably shouldn't do this and like like I mean okay the owner I believe this is the owner yeah yeah I can see over here on my other screen Mr. Vin is this owner here for the server we're gonna see we're, we're gonna we're gonna see what uh Mr. Vin has uh has to offer this is just a survival or something interesting though that I already have stone tools here. Now, what is this? How to claim land. That's cool. Claim the land to protect your stuff. Click the link above to learn land claims in three minutes or less. Our claim tools are golden shovel and stick. Ah, okay. So they have a land claim system. That's good. I mean, it prevents griefing. All right. So let's go ahead and explore it and see if I can find anybody out in the wild. We'll, we'll see. Oh, is that a person? I, I feel like it. Mm, maybe not. Okay. Anyway, let's go explore, I guess. <laughs> There's not much to it, to be honest. From what I can tell, um, yeah, this is just your average everyday SMP with a few land claim options. Now, back when I was planning this video, the original point was to get banned off of this server and all the other servers I join. But I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to really try that. We'll see. Maybe with the worst ones. But this one actually seems like a nice one. So, uh... We'll see. I mean... From what I can tell so far, this is just your, uh... Average landscape. So I wouldn't necessarily call this, uh... Well, what, what do you call it? Pristine landscape. I mean... By all technicality, I guess. Yeah, it is pristine. That doesn't really count. I think considering that I'm chopping down birch. Sorry, came in. Um, I think there's only one thing appropriate to do to go go back and pay homage to my roots. If uh, picking up what I'm putting down. <laughs> Fart lol. So, from what I can tell, from what the owner is telling me, this server was just recently set up. That's probably why they're at the bottom of the list. Because last time I checked, I don't believe they were there. So, I mean... If these servers do well, I think really great kind of promotion for the server. For each... and I keep saying server. But I feel like it serves really good promotion for these guys. If each owner can properly show off a good server and manage it well, then I guess I can recommend it. That's I guess that's one way we can rate the servers. I'm going to write the most beautiful sign the world has ever seen. Now I'm also going to kind of make this. Gaming man 247 has requested to teleport to me. All right, do I do I do I let him? Yeah, let, let's see. Let's see. Ooh, he almost knocked me off. Oh, he's did he just try to kill me? <laughs> I think he's I think I left this man very confused. Just telling him to shh. I'm doing something, buddy. Is he gonna try and claim this land? I swear to God. 
Or is he gonna try and kill me? I, I think he's gonna try and kill me. You little bitch. Dude! <laughs> oh my god. Yes, you can hit people. Of course you can. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we're good. Wait. I'm here. Okay. Okay. Try to write a sign, man. Okay, we're taking off points for that. Minus points. That doesn't have to be perfect. Oh my god, that's beautiful. Now, of course, I could have done the composite wood like I did before. But, I would say, in a birch biome. Kind of far out. Bart, lol. Oh, I miss those days. I think that's enough for this server. From what I can tell, it's a uh, survival server. There's not much else to it. So, let's head on to the next server. All right, next server up is Crusadercraft. This was the PVE server where everybody feels unique, and it's an MMORPG experience. This one is on 1.19.4. It's based out of the UK. It seems to be vanilla, PvP, you know, PVE. There's factions, economy. So, yeah, it's one of those guys. I don't really know what to expect, but we'll see. We'll see. I, uh, don't really know what to expect. Considering I have yet to get a ping back. I don't know. Wait. <laughs> this server... This server is down! Oh my god, okay. So it just doesn't exist. I'm on 1.19.4, you guys can see down here in the corner. That's funny. Wow. Okay. Automatic F for Crusader Craft. Do not recommend because, well, you can't even play it. Guys, guys. So I'm looking at this. Apparently they have three out of 30 players online. But it just doesn't connect. Uh, I mean, if I can't connect using the IP on the website, then uh, do you really... I don't know. It, I, I can't do it. All right, everyone. Next server up is the Chill SMP. So, they have a store. Concerning. All right. So, let's go ahead. Question is, do we actually get a ping this time? Come on. So far, Bloom SMP is in the lead. Come on. I'm just going to connect. Oh, and we're in. Already, it's okay. They have an actual lobby. Hold on. Let me change my texture packs just real quick. I, I can't chat. Okay. Minus points are ready. But I do like the lobby. Um, what are the chances that they actually built this themselves? Who knows? But it seems like I'm get I'm getting like huge high pixel vibes here, or like somewhat decent, I guess. Minecraft server. We'll we'll see. Um, not really sure just yet. So chill S and P. We it's hard to read this. It shows a horrible color. It's okay. Weekly updates, custom items, never resets, and keep inventory. Okay. Hide players. Ah, that's kind of cool. Server selector. So this seems to be... Hmm. Maybe they plan on adding more fu future servers. Maybe they add on, you know, adding more servers in the future here because it seems like you might be able to choose multiple. Server info. Okay, that's their Discord, blah, blah, blah. Just so you guys know, I'm blurring out all the Discords. Just, there, whatever. All right. Let's join. The server recommends the use of a custom resource pack. Would you like to download it? Automatically. Yeah, okay. We're going to go ahead and download the resource pack because, well, that's what they want, I guess. Okay. Let's see. Interesting spawn. That is scary. Server map. Okay. I'm not seeing a map. But they, they got, like, the whole thing. Oh, it's Wumpus. Yeah. Take a shower or something. What the hell is that? Whoa, look at that headgear. Oh my god. Look at the pixel density on that. Okay, um, anyway, that's pretty detailed. You got jobs, real estate agent. Let's see, to buy and sell claims and build with ease. Okay, pawn warp. 
Oh, I guess fishing is a thing. This is fucking adopt me in Roblox. Player warps. I don't like how they look at me when I get close. I, like, I don't like that. That makes me feel uncomfortable. Okay. They got crates. Judging by their website, I believe this is a pay to win server. Okay. All right, so what is in here? Yep, more crates. Okay, this is definitely a pay to win server. Need to teleport around. Quick cash. Yeah, okay, pay to win. Jeez, okay. How do I, like, play? Travel hub. Main world. Let's go to the main world. Am I just in a random place? They have a really low render distance, or their server is just terrible. Something's telling me it's a ladder. I seem to have some stake and torches, but no starting tools, which is interesting. And they don't respond. Ooh, an arrow! Oh, would you look at that? Little cobblestone base here. I feel like this arrow is guiding me in, and of course, me being me, I'm gonna go in. See anything I can steal? E pick an Enderwitz base. Go in at your warm risk. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna borrow all this stuff. Do I care about getting banned? No, this is a pay to win server. I'm gonna break their beds because screw their spawn. You know what? I'm feeling mean today. We're gonna destroy this guy's base. <laughs> just gonna. Get rid of it. He hasn't claimed land because I believe you can do that, from what I can tell. So I'm just going to permanently get rid of this base. And uh, what I'll do, I'm going to blame this on the admins. All right, let's see uh, what else there is on this server. So far, impressions are not great. Off to a horrible start, considering the pay-to-win part. All right. Well, very disappointing, to be honest. So, to the next server. All right, we're on the last one here, considering it won't even connect. I have low expectations. Hello. Oh, would you look at that? Must join their Discord? Hmm. No, not doing that. And something I just noticed about this chill SMP, the last one I just played. Their refund policy on their website. All payments are final and non-refundable. Attempting a chargeback or opening a PayPal dispute will result in permanent and irreversible banishment from all our servers and other Minecraft stores. So that means, clearly, it's a big enough problem where people are trying to get their money back from spending it on this server. To the point where they have to have a policy written about refunds. That, that is interesting. All right, so it's time to rank the lists. So the two servers that we couldn't connect to, you know, they get automatic zeros. Because, well, why? Why would they get anything higher if I have nothing to rate it on? So, zeros, and this is going to be out of five. We're going to be rating every server out of five. So these two get a zero out of five. Next up is the chill SMP, which was the pay to win one, I believe. And well, it's pay to win. So is it really that good? I mean, the survival experience itself was nothing special, but it definitely was still a survival experience. Um, you just got randomly teleported somewhere in the world, you know, just bog standard stuff really for a server. <clears throat> It did seem like they have plans for expanding in the future, which is good, I guess? Maybe? I don't know. For a pay-to-win, I don't know if that's good. Either way, it seems like they have some ambition to expand their server into other things, but at the moment, it seems like it is just the SMP. Next up is the chill SMP. Oh, I forgot to even give them a rating. So, considering the pay-to-win, I'm going to give it a... I'm going to give it a 2 out of 5. Because it's nothing special, and the pay-to-win really, really brings it down. Because that's just not something you do, and I'm 90% sure that's against Minecraft's EULA anyways. The Bloom SMP. That was the one I really liked, where I talked with the owner. Apparently, we joined right when it started up. 
It seemed all right. It seemed very, very basic, though. There didn't seem to be, like, any plugins or anything like that. It was just survival. That's all it was. So, of course, you know, you might have to take off a point for that. So, just because there was nothing special, and also they are down right now, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. Not a 4, but a 3 out of 5. And, of course, if any of these server owners, if they're even watching, which I really doubt they are, I really doubt it. If they are, say hi to me. And if your server evolves over time, maybe, I don't know, let me know and I'll take a second look. I'm not sure. Anyways, that wraps it up for today's video. Feel free to join my Discord down below. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and you like the video. Hit the like button, please. Especially because I haven't uploaded it in a while. But please, hit the like button, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.